Hey everyone, welcome back to BDG Reviews. It's night 18 of the 31 Days of Horror. Uh, we've got you tonight's review of the movie Oddity. I literally just got finished watching this right now. It's actually still on my screen right there. <laughs> so, yeah, this is a 2024 movie. Uh, basic plot of this is this woman... Uh, how, how can I describe it? Es essentially... This man, this woman, they, they got this house. She Like, she's fixing it up sort of thing. And he's like a psychiatrist. And he's like away a at night. Um, she ends up, you know, uh, like locking up for the night. And someone comes and knocks on the door. Like, she's been out to her car, you know, to like I put her phone there or something like that. Um, and... So she comes back in, there's a knock at the door, and she opens it, and there's a really weird looking guy. Got like a f one fake eye and everything, and you know, and he's right close to the door and everything, and he's like, you know, you gotta come outside. Um, like, I was watching, when you went to your car, someone slipped in behind you. Now, he also knows her husband. So he, you know, so she pretty much rightly, you know, thinks like, okay, uh, there's a weird guy at my house in the middle of the night telling me to, to let him in and like, or me come out and he's, uh, he knows my husband. So, you know, why does he know the husband? You know, it's quickly determined this guy is batshit crazy. So we cut forward in time. Uh, the wife has been murdered, and uh, it's about a year later, and the psychiatrist guy goes to her sister, who has, like, this antique store, and uh, basically the whole thing is, like, the antique store, everything in it is cursed, and, you know, uh, her whole shtick is, like, you know, um, like, everything's in here cursed, like, uh, the curse gets removed when you buy the item. Yeah, so, you know, it sounds like a, excuse me, it sounds like a, you know, like using superstition to guard your shit sort of thing. So, you know, they're talking or whatever, and it's like, uh, he said, like, you should come around to the house sometime. Like, him and his new girlfriend are now living there. Um, in the meantime, though, he's brought her the prosthetic eye of the guy that that killed her because you know she really wanted it she got it because he's since died in in like an insane asylum so she gets it she you know touches the eye and everything we cut forward again i think it's a couple of weeks or whatever and she shows up at their house with a, with like a, and she sent a a big like, wooden crate. And it quickly becomes evident, you know, that there there's a lot more going on here than we think. I'll, I'm going to leave it there for the plot. Let's just say this involves cursed items. It involves, like, revenge. It involves, like, who killed the wife. Was it this crazy guy or, or something else? I'll just leave it at that. This movie was damn good. It really was. Um, this is one I've been sleeping on, honestly. Um, you know, I've I, I've seen it around. I've seen, like, the ads for it. And I was kind of like, nah, I don't know if I really want to watch that or not. I am regretting now that I didn't watch this sooner because I thoroughly enjoyed it. The acting is top-notch. The effects are top-notch. Um... Uh, the atmosphere that this builds. I mean, in, in well, just says in this crate that she sends it. This isn't a spoiler. It's literally on the cover. There's a life-size wooden man, really creepy looking one. And you know, as you can no doubt guess, just kind of by the whole nature of the thing. You know, something that shouldn't be moving around is moving around. It's creepy as hell. It really is. 
the there the ghosts show up in this. There's a couple of shots of uh, the wife as a ghost, and it's genuinely creepy. Completely wide eyes and kind of like you know messed up and everything. All in all, really really solid film. For a rating, you know, I I have to give this ten out of ten. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Uh, if you haven't seen Oddity, go out of your way to see it. It's streaming on Shutter. Um, I know there's like a, I think there's a DVD and a blue release of it, I think. Um, but I think, I think it's probably streaming some other places as well. But if you get the chance, watch it. You know, honestly, what I've told you now is just scratching the surface. Um, don't read any, don't read more into it. Don't, you know, look up any spoilers or whatever. Just watch the movie. And enjoy it, because it's damn good. And it, <laughs> and the ending. I'm not gonna spoil the ending, but it's one of those moments where you're ju you just smile, you know, like like something like happens, and you're just like, oh yeah, and you're just happy with it. So yeah. There you go. 10 out of 10 oddity. Definitely recommend it. If you get the chance, see it, buy it, steal it, whatever you have to do. Um, but it's definitely worth watching and you won't regret it. That's it for me. See you tomorrow.